Hi, this is DH Dunn, and I'm here to ask myself an ongoing question. How long can I lope without meters? I'm really grooving on this scene right now. I don't think I've ever seen the menu screen with clear weather at night and the glow of the fire coming from the uh, train station there. Very cool. Very, very cool. All right, stickies are on the screen. Uh, it is time to get into no meters. So let's load it up. The UI is shut down. Astrid 3 is our, our Black Rock exploration. Here's no meters. Lope day 24. We just arrived at Broken Railroad. Uh, a somewhat unscheduled <laughs> arrival. It wasn't the plan. Uh, I think I went outside from trappers in search of food, maybe, and like somehow we ended up here. You know, as you do. As you do. Okay. So Astrid is super tired. I don't know exactly how tired she is. I don't really know what time of day it is. Um, I would love to make a few more arrowheads while we are here. I do think we have enough coal to do that. I don't know that we have enough scrap to do it, though. And we don't have a um, hacksaw. So we also may not have a hammer, actually. <laughs> Now that I think about it. No, we do. I can't believe I actually have the hammer with me. I'm, I'm Frankly, I'm stunned. I'm truly stunned. I'm going to put the match in this uh, barrel so that we don't lose it. While I just kind of case the joint. One piece of scrap gets us two arrowheads. Thanks. Thanks, Esther. That's fantastic. That Come on. You could not get that Come fire started. think four scrap for a knife look at our our uh, tool situation here in a second ah oh, shit I didn't mean to put that in there I think it's still fine it's still fine okay. um actually grab this put that in there don't put another coal in there where there's more than enough coal you need eight coal to get the furnace hot we have seven on us and there's some over there all right, uh, scrap that we have is zero. We do have the hatchet. Do we Do we have any, we have plenty of whetstones. We need to just take better care of our hatchet, to be honest. Not let it get uh, so low condition. That's something I should be doing with my time when I have to pass time, which everybody knows I can't stand doing. Um, I do wish... If I could make mods, I would make one where I couldn't see these percentages, and I would instead have to go by the description. Although I don't know that it changes. It changes for food. Like this is a, this isn't just a granola bar, it's a stale granola bar. But anyway, uh, water situation, shitty. Let's put some water on anyway. Um, that's not what we do. This is what we do with our incredible can. Okay, scrappy scrap. Let's take a look. Even one piece, I think, makes it worth it. I guess we'll go through these while we're doing this. Don't need that. It is cold, rainy, and windy outside. It is just gross here today in Maine. So I said, you know what I want to do? I want to play a game where I'm cold and windy. But I have warm fires. So it makes it all right. I should be more excited about that. I'm not that excited about it. The, th the thermoses don't excite me that much. They are useful. Um, but they're pretty common. Uh, no. No, but I'll take that for now, anyway. I could uh, harvest that for scrap, and um, I think somehow, somehow Astrid can harvest that by hand. Pillow? No, I can't do that. It's too hard. A broom? No, can't harvest a broom. Need a hacksaw for that. What are you, crazy? You can't break a broom over your knee. That's just insanity. Pry bar, though? Yeah, you can shred that metal with your bare hands. No problem. 
No problem. It's the little things. <laughs> yeah. Alright, those crackers are usually there. Those matches are usually there. In my dream fantasy world, that coffee is always there. Okay. Um, scrap. You're supposed to be looking for scrap. Don't go through all this crap. It's not going to have scrap. Oh, we're going to get, um, uh, scrap for, uh, scrap. We're going to get water from the toilet, too. I'm going to, oh, look at this. I don't need to bring a hacksaw. One will be provided for you. Wow. Well, the shit is on now. And, uh, match-wise, yeah, I'm not even super worried. Yeah, good, good grief. Our match situation is great. I'm not worried about keeping that fire going now. I think uh, the plot just changed. I don't like how I'm sitting. It's not that comfortable. Maybe a little better. Hopefully the audio issues are all resolved now. Um, I apologize for them. Windows decided to change a setting on me. So you know what if what if we set your microphone to seventy percent and didn't tell you that we did that? You don't record anything, do you? You don't use your microphone. Man, that hacksaw find was huge. Alright. So yeah, I'm not I'm not super stressed about keeping that fire going now. I think instead I want to focus on Probably breaking stuff down. Definitely got the coal that we need to do our shenanigans, but we probably will do those in the morning. I don't hear her complaining about anything, which, Astrid, are you okay? You're not complaining. I'm, I'm concerned about this. Did I check you? Yes. Did I check this? It's just a box. No, this. Did I check this? No, but I might as well have. Alright. One of these boxes, if you break them down, there's goodies in them. I can never remember which one it is. Clank, 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 clank. It should be this one, right? Yeah, I'm just going to let that go. I'm going to break this down. It wasn't that one. <laughs> Is it this one? Are you hungry? I don't. I don't want you. Doesn't seem so crazy. Okay. 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 You're thirsty. You're thirsty. All right. Gotcha. 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 There we go. All right. Maybe I give you just a little food. How are we on food? Now we're in better shape. Twenty-one cattails is nice too. How about you just had this little candy bar? And maybe chips. I should have had those before I drank. Why don't you eat uh, cattails instead? I don't know how much to eat, though. I don't know. I don't know. I'll just hope this was enough. I highly doubt I have well fed anyway. So just break this down. Okay. Um, I forgot I'd want a light. Okay, we'll look in the morning to see if anything was there. I'm sorry, Astrid, what was that? Astrid, I need to get back to the, um, oh god. Astrid, you, no. I really hate that I have to do this, but... I don't think I'm, especially, yeah. Okay, she's hungry. Okay, well, guess what? Okay, we're walking into the, uh, truck there. I should have thought about that. I didn't really know what time of day it was, though. In my defense. Hey, soup. Nice. Okay. So the hard part of No Meter's Astrid is knowing how to go to sleep. Um, with her, you know, not 
losing uh, condition while she sleeps due to hunger. So the only way I know to solve that, well, there's two ways. One, technically, technically when I click the bed, it's going to say my calorie. But I didn't look at it. I try not to look at it. Um, it's hard, you know. I can't put a sticky right in the middle of the damn screen. So I do the best I can with just not not looking there. Guys, if, this, if you've watched me for a while, if this one thing I'm good at, it's not looking. I'm really good at that. <laughs> I don't see lots of things. <laughs> so um, I'm going to try to just eat until I can't eat anymore. And that's how I know that she's all set. Clink, clink, clink. Put this out. World's weakest match usage. Okay, we'll start with this stuff. Hmm. It's definitely one of the challenges of this mode, is just managing the food when you don't ha know how much you've eaten. Now I just eat cattails until she can't eat anymore. It's <laughs> wildly inefficient. I also picture her eating a full box of crackers, um, a bag of chips, tomato soup, and then just like jamming cattails into her face. Wow, she was really hungry. So I was probably starving or close to it. So I probably lost well-fed, which life goes on. You guys know how I feel about well-fed. All right, let's give him a big sleep. What? Not that big. Nine. All right. Have a drink. I don't have as much water as I'd like. I do have that water on the barrel that I didn't go pick up. Try to sleep two more. Okay. I'd say it's showtime. Can I have this please? Oh, you burned off, didn't you? I'm so stupid. Oh, well, life goes on. Um, we need to break some things down. Like that. Little projects, maybe. How long would you take? Hour 30? I don't know about that. Maybe. Hour 30 to get me four. Or, conversely, ipso facto, hour 30 to get me four. Two and 45. Eh, it's the same math. Time to die, pale. All right, that gives me, what, four? four which would give me eight arrowheads so really the only question is do i want to make a knife as well while i am here um be bop a dee dee bop 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 knife 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 also requires four no three so I think if I go grab this, that should be sufficient. Yeah. Give me this. She's probably starving again. I wonder if the radio still works on the ground during an aurora. All right, Astrid. Um, can you eat these? No. Can you prepare these, though? Prepare these and then eat them. Yeah, 
There you go. A little crunch. Okay. Um. I didn't start. Oh, well, I did start the fire. I, I started the fire. These are the dumbest, lowest hanging fruit jokes. <laughs> Just song references. Silly. I'm in a fairly uh, silly mood today. I'm not sure why. It happens. Uh, take that unclaimed. Wow. We, oh, yeah. We broke down a whole bunch of uh, stuff. That's why. All right. Now, extinguish that. Coal. Sure, 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 sure. That's fine. That's fine. We got plenty of time. Okay. Over here. Give me one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And let's do a water here. Oh, that's right. We have two cans now. I don't think we can put a second one up there. Despite there's an enormous flat surface here where we could put things. But no. I don't know if that was enough. Wall. This is probably up to temp by this point, but we're going to let that go again. Okay, just take that. No, take it. All right, now, can we forgeify? We can. How about a knife? Thank you. We drink again. I don't hear her complaining about being hungry. Give me some arrows. All Heads. Think about his food. All she can think about is food. Okay, she's hungry again. Okay, Astrid. We'll tell you what we're going to do. You are going to eat your remaining cattails. This will probably do it. I banged the mic uh, microphone arm there. Sorry. I knew my brain would do this. As soon as I got to Broken Railroad, my brain would be like, you should go get that stem. It's right up there in the cabin. You're so close to it. Yeah. We should. Already here. Um, I only have two. Okay, can we make more arrows, please? I like that key change there. Are we losing our fire? Feels like we're losing our fire. Um, she's probably super tired, too, but how much more can we do? We can do more arrowheads. We have three left. All right, so we could do six more arrowheads. Um, if you were to do this, I think you wouldn't melt or, or burn away. That sound isn't right. That didn't sound like forging. Do that again. That sounded like harvesting. Um, there, that sounds like for, uh, forging. Watch out, watch out, watch out. There we go. Okay, throw one more um, unclaimed wood in there. Give me another water. This is a good combo. Water and arrowheads. Grab it. Go again. One more. One more and then it's off to bed.
I guess it does make that noise. Okay, that was weird. Okay. Um, groovy. Super cool. Can I just have a torch, please? Take a torch. Keep taking them till you can't take them. This might take a while. We don't know. And this pack is getting kind of heavy. Yep. All right, maybe don't keep taking them until you can't take them. Take that. All right, I want to check something at this workbench quick. Which is, how many arrows can I make? We don't know. We'll find out tomorrow. Excuse me. Pardon me. Coming through. All right, um, let's get these other Burbanks uh, set up here. We'll eat those. We're probably going to burn through our available food here. There are cattails outside. Why do I not see uh, the Burbank? Just worried that she's close to starving again. Um, okay, well, have a drink. See what she says in the morning. Can you sleep nine? I'm not sure that you can. Okay. I didn't think it would be daylight in nine hours. She's not complaining about being hungry. Let's take a peek out here. Get a little fresh air. Cabin fever should start to be an issue here pretty soon also. Which is not great because we don't have a bedroll. I think... Does sleeping out here uh, take care of cabin fever? I'm not sure that it does. Can you? Thank you. <laughs> You're freaking hilarious. Oh, TLD. You expert troller. No, we already opened that. It, huh? So be it. I did want to know what it was like out. Alright, a little wolfier than I'd hoped. Oh, I never looked to see if I got something from this. Hey, I did. Oh my god, pick it up. Thank you. Did I check over here? I did not. Oh, that's a wheel. Alright, well, after an exhaustive search of this room. I see you spray paint, I just don't care. 
Uh, back over here. Did I check you, green box? Green box. Yes, I did. Okay. Make me an arrow, please. Uh, sure. Hmm. It's promising. That's her 50% thirsty lip smack. <laughs> I've learned that one. It cracks me up. I had somebody on Twitch say that they can't play Astrid because they can't handle that that specific noise. And I know oh, I've known people for whom that noise is just maddening them. And yeah, it's not an ASMR sound. It's not good. Okay, all right, all right. So uh, arrow totals would be oh we have two two pry bars now that's good double the pleasure uh double the fun let's see uh somewhere in my inventory i still have seven more and i've got six seven eight arrows okay i'm pretty happy with that there is a workbench up at the um uh cabin let me take a look at our recording time though yeah, I think we can try a quick run to the cabin. I don't want to do that without a torch. The question is, can I light it with the mag lens? I think the answer to that is yes. If I mag lensify fire. I like Broken Railroad. I, I think Broken Railroad is a, is a good map. I think it is. Come on, little fire. I don't want to say underappreciated because I don't hear people bagging on Broken Railroad a lot, but neither do I hear people say, oh, man, I freaking love Broken Railroad. I do. I, I think it's a decent map. It's got some areas that are kind of dead, but um, I like it. It's, it. It reminds me a lot of DP in that it is a map that I find easier to deal with than some of the bigger maps. This area around here, though, is dangerous. I have lost multiple runs here. Right right where we are right now. All these little rolling hills and stuff. You can surprise a wolf and then it's just instantly in charge mode. This uh, little lake here is a very high traffic area. The bear is on it. The uh, wolves are generally on it. Um got some good you know cattails and resources there so you generally want to come check it out there are at least three wolves on the ice right now but they're all down at that end i'd like to check the hunter's blind Just a little peek. Just make sure the big boy isn't walking around. Nope, just the little boys. Just the Borky boys. Thanks for nothing. I'm gonna need to eat soon. Astrid, that is just universally always true. Astrid is just constantly she's like she's like a little kid. She's just always asking for food. It's like every day with her. It's like she wants food every day. It's ridiculous. It's it's ridiculous. Water too? Just the the demands are endless. I've said this before. Um I tease Astrid a lot. Um, I'm actually Sometimes I feel a little bad, <laughs> but I know you can turn the um, the voice, you know, commentary off. I would never, I would never do that. I love bickering with Astrid. I find it super fun, even though she always says the same shit. I still love it. 
I also like when I play Ash and Will picking out the differences in the performance of the same lines and then the unique lines that each of them has. Um, Will will say, is it food? And I've never heard Astrid say that. Um, will will say, I'm so hungry I can eat a horse. And so will Astrid, but sometimes she'll add. And that's saying a lot because I love horses. I think that's an improv line from Jennifer Hale because I know from being a Jennifer Hale fan that she does love horses. So I, I think she, she uh, worked that one in there. All right, weather is working on going sideways, but we should get there ahead of it. This approach can be a bit harrowing at times. Depends on who's where. But if there's a moose here, we got eight arrows now. That's an entirely different situation than having three. And we're very close to the Can I Lope PB. Celebrating the Can I Lope PB with um, like hitting day 30 with a moose. That'd be pretty cool. But I don't see him. There's definitely a wolf here. Don't even try to tell me there isn't one. Nope, there is. There always is. Yeah, there's another one over there. They get lots of rabbits here, so a lot of times they're, they're chewing on a rabbit. I'll come around from the side so that we get him in an appropriate way. Don't scare me, bunny. All right. We got in here unborked. And I'm going to take the save that we get going through this door. What secrets await us inside the Broken Railroad Cabin? We will have to find out next time. But we had a very productive the, uh, session today thanks to finding a, a, a hacksaw right in the forge we managed to make eight well we're up to eight arrows we made more than eight arrows we made a knife um i think very very productive we got some matches we're about to get a stim and who knows what else this place is going to give us so um really really happy with how this is going uh that's going to do it for this one let's see what day we're on 26 day 26 we're getting so close so close so that will do it for this one if you could do the youtube things if you've enjoyed the video um like, comment, subscribe, those all really, really help me. We just passed 450 subscribers. I'm blown away. I'm blown away. So, so cool. So very, very cool. You guys are awesome. I'll be back tomorrow with more adventures in the long dark. Until then, stay safe, take care of each other, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.